Hey, hier ist Kiwana and welcome to the year 2024. I hope you had a really great and exciting start into this year. Sorry for my little absent from this YouTube channel. I was busy reading books and also preparing the makeup for another fashion show, which is actually quite a lot of work. But here I'm back with some really, really exciting news for you. I got a cooperation with the Atropolis Festival and that means I can give away four guestless places for the Atropolis Festival 2024. And if you want to find out how to enter and how to win one of those guestless places, then please watch this video until the end. The so Tropolis Festival is like the little sister of the Amphi Festival. It's organized by the same organization. This year it's on the 2nd of March 2024. It's a one day festival, so Saturday only, but you got a pre party, you got an after party. So it's quite a long time to enjoy music, to enjoy bands, and just have a really, really good time. The location is in Oberhausen in the Turbinenhalle. Like really massive indoor location, really gorgeous. I absolutely love it there. Really, really enjoyable. So I hope that I see some, if not no, well, all would be maybe too much, but a lot of you on the 2nd of March in Oberhausen in the Turbinenhalle. So the Tropolis Festival really focuses on the electronic side of gross music. So if you're into EBM or like harsh electro, any like of the many, 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 many uh, electronic subgenres, and that is a festival that really focuses on that, which is really nice. And from the lineup for this year, I'm most excited to see Suicide Commando, Nachtma, SRDD and Frozen Plasma. I will put the lineup here. To, for you to check whether they are like bands that you would be also interested to see. So my plan for this year is arrive on March 1st in Oberhausen, then get ready, go to the pre-party, not to stay too long there because I need to be fully awake next morning to get ready to go then to a full day of festival. And then I just really want to dance there, have fun, listen to really good music, meet like friends and nice people and everything. And then stay until the after party, stay as long as possible until the after party go to sleep and then the, like the next day um, obviously go back home. Besides the obvious of like good bands, good music, dancing and having fun there, there's also like a big massive food court there. So also last time I was there I had like really nice vegan food. I hope they still have that there but I'm pretty sure. And besides like really good food you also got a tiny area of like uh, black market, not in a black market sense but like buying like a little bit of cost stuff. And I really enjoy that uh, from every festival that I go to. I usually bring like one uh, clothing item or accessory with me. So that is kind of like where I say, okay, I can pick one item so I don't like overspend or anything, but like one item that I really like, I always bring that with me. So I remember the festival and have something for future festival outfits or photo shooting outfits. So that's what I'm planning to do also like picking a tiny piece of whatever I find there to bring with me. So the Turbine Hall in general is like a massive indoor venue. If I remember correctly, you like kind of wait in the queues and get in. And then you got like a little arrival area where you can also exchange your money for like little paper thingies. Um, I kind of like food stamps. I'm not sure whether that's the correct term, but it makes it a little bit easier for later on to get food and get drinks, uh, exchange that there, and then you don't have to like look for money and they have to exchange and everything. Um, so you can do that in the entrance area and then there's also like already a possibility to buy like a little bit of drinking. And then you can like go into the festival area, which is like massive. You got two big stages. One is on the one side of the hall, one is on the other. Something separates the two. My mind doesn't go well with that anymore, but I will show you also clips of the Atropos Festival where you can see that. And then there's also the possibility to like put away some of your stuff into lockers and everything. Area where the bands are playing is quite dark, which really puts you in this like concert atmosphere. But if you just need a little bit break um, and like just like chill a bit, then the food area is really nice for that. So to wrap it up, the Troopers Festival is a great way to start your festival season early because usually it gets warm in Germany in May, cold already in September, so it's quite a short time for like bigger festivals. And it's also a great festival if you like the more electronic side of gospel music. So I definitely recommend going to the Tropolis Festival. And since I now talked so much about the festival, I will go into how you can actually win one of the four guestless prizes that I can give away. So winning one of the four guestless places is actually quite easy. Just leave a comment under this video which bands you're most excited to see this year or why else you really want to go to the Atropolis Festival. You got five days to leave your comments and I will close this uh, giveaway 
I will put all the information that you need also in the description, which is not quite a lot. It's easy. Leave your comment. I will pick winners. You have five days to leave a comment and then I will contact you via email with, hey, you have a guest list place. Um, even if you don't win, I'm really, really excited to see hopefully many, many of you at the Atropolis Festival. We really need our goth festivals, our goth bands to be here, to be around, to have our community together. So that's, I'm really, really excited to work together with the Atropolis Festival. If you feel extra nice today, leave this video a thumbs up and if you're feeling extra extra nice also go to the youtube channel of the amphi festival crew and leave them a like or leave them a like at the facebook page of the Tripolis festival everything here to support our community so see you on one of my next videos see you hopefully at the Tripolis festival and in my comments